When Florida Governor Rick Scott took office in 2011, the Sunshine State's economy was looking a little, well, gloomy. In the months before his swearing in, unemployment hovered around 11 percent, not to mention Florida's greatest industry, tourism, was suffering. But in the five years since Scott became Florida's chief executive, the sun is shining on Florida's economy once more. I grew up in public housing. I know the importance of a job. I watched my parents lose their jobs, their parent and my father's car get repossessed. Jobs are the most important thing we can do. So I think when you, you run, you tell people what you're going to do. Since becoming governor, Scott has been praised for implementing pro-growth, free market policies that have grown Florida's economy. Over the last five years, Florida has added more than one million private sector jobs, and the state's unemployment rate fell to 5 percent. The state has also cut more than 3,000 regulations over the last five years, cut taxes more than 50 times, and cut nearly 11,000 government jobs. Everybody likes our weather. Right? <laughs> we, don't, we don't have uh, D.C. snow, uh, as an example. But uh, they like our weather, they like our workforce, uh, they like our lower taxes, they like the fact that you can get a permit fast, they like the fact they don't have as many regulations to comply with, they like the fact that 20 million people live in our state, we have four of the uh, fastest growing seaports in the country. We've got the expansion of the Panama Canal. There's just opportunity after opportunity after opportunity. Think about when you go buy things. Have you ever walked into a store and said, you know what, I know you're in a high tax area, I'll pay a little bit more. Or I know your place has a lot of regulations that you have to comply with, so I'll pay a little bit more money. You don't. If we want jobs in our cities, our counties, our states, or our country, we've got to focus on reducing regulation. Only have regulation that really we, ha we need to have. Not, thing, not things we don't. People across the country are taking notice of Florida's success. According to 2014 census data, nearly 1,000 people are moving from blue states like New York to red states like Florida daily. So what does Scott think of Florida's economic success? You know, our policies work. We create an environment where people want to live. If you just think about your family for a second, what do you care about? You want a job? Well, we have almost 300,000 job openings. You want your kids to get a great education? whether it's K-12, state college, or universities, we're doing really well in our state. And you live in a safe neighborhood. We're at a 44 and a half year low in our crime rate. That's where you want to live.